This is so fire. I'm gonna show you how to turn yourself into a prompt engineering wizard with just one image. It's that simple. OMG. All you have to do is just upload an image in the chat GPT. Then follow the steps I'm about to show you in this video. And boom. You're not only gonna get some of the best prompts you've ever gotten, but then I'll show you how to get an infinite amount of pro level prompts by creating prompt generators. Okay, so here we are on chat GPT and you can already see that this method has been giving me some incredible results. Tons of ultimate prompts, just like the ones you see right here. The improvement level is insane from the original prompt of these three right here, scrolling down, then they get a lot more detailed. And then finally, I'm gonna have this create prompt generator after prompt generator, all based off of one uploaded image. So recently, I have been generating some of the best looking AI images with this method. So let's go ahead and go directly to the prompt. Now I am in my prompt generators database. This database will basically allow you to never need prompts again because the hundreds of prompts that are in here are all prompt generators or prompts that generate prompts. For amazing prompts databases, click the links in the description. And as a quick reminder, any prompts I share in any of my YouTube videos are always available 100% free via the links in the description. I'll go to my gallery view and here it is right here. It is called the image wizard. Now what you'll notice is that this prompt actually contains three steps. But with those three simple steps, the results you're going to get are incredible. So the first step is very simple. We're first going to upload a high quality image into chat GPT. So let's say for my first image, I want to upload one of these images right here of this mega mansion. Okay. Now you're going to upload the specific image that you want to get a prompt for to create future prompts. So for an example, if I uploaded an image like this one of like an AI influencer, then those are specifically the sort of prompts I'm going to end up getting. It's all going to be based on the actual image that you upload. So check this out. I'm going to go ahead and upload this one of this mansion, just like that. Go in here and drop it in the chat GPT. The second thing you're going to do is enter this specific phrase right here. Go ahead and copy this exact phrase. And now remember, as a reminder, this prompt I'm sharing today will be available via the link in the description as well. Now I said in detail, give me three prompts that made this image plus another three prompts that are improved 10x better based on ChatGPT's preferred method for prompting. Okay, let's go ahead and do just that. Now instantly, that's going to give us six prompts total. Three are going to be basic. The three after that are going to be even better, 10x better based on ChatGPT's preferred method. And here we go, just like that. You could see that. Look, very standard prompts, which is important because what we want to do is improve everything we're doing from basic to pro level. Now, as we scroll down, here we go. Optimized 10x better prompts. Prompt one, prompt two, and prompt three. Here's what's so important about this one. These specific keywords, for an example, the camera mentioned along with the lens, I know specifically that this Leica SL2 is going to produce some amazing looking results in addition to the Ari Alexa 65 and now one of my favorites, the Canon EOS R5. Now, look at this at the bottom. Now, you won't get this question all of the time, but if you did say yes to this, this will take your images to a whole new level. But if yours doesn't do that, that's no problem because this next step is going to do just that. So let's go ahead and go to our next step, which is going to be next, say this. Go ahead and copy the third and final step right here. And exactly what we're going to say is this. Now, make them even better again more details, cameras, angles, lenses, more precise and descriptive to produce ultimate levels of realism. And now here we go right here. Now, again, right away, I think that's already nine amazing prompts. And now if you look at these right here, even more levels of detail, we get a different camera, the phase one IQ four, plus this amazing lens, more details with the lighting, the shadows, a lot more thorough. And I even like what it says down here at the very bottom, architectural digest cover quality, which is so important and helpful because when you do mention specific magazines, like for an example, this image right here and this one right here was created by using the keyword Vogue fashion magazine, editorial or professional photo shoot style. Once you use keywords like that, the images really do reflect that level of professionalism. Okay, so there we have it. Now, even more amazing prompts. What happens if you want to get more and more like this? What if you don't know to say Hasselblad H6D? No problem. That is where this next step and perhaps the most valuable one comes in. Here we go. Lastly, add this prompt. Go ahead and copy the whole entire thing until the very end. 
just like this. Now, back to chat GPT, let's go ahead and paste it in. Look at this. Now, it's basically saying, carefully assess the conversation, okay? Based on our discussion, I want a prompt generator. A true prompt generator, reusable meta prompt, acts like your personal prompt engineer, but it's specifically gonna be built around the actual image that's uploaded. And let's see what chat GPT's response is. Okay, step one, upload your image. Once you upload the image, I'll return with, look at this, amazing prompt generators. Now, I know in the beginning, I did recommend doing a few steps first by uploading an image and then saying multiple times, make the prompts better and better, which is gonna be helpful, but technically you can skip all of those steps and go straight to the prompt I just pasted to get a meta prompt generator right away. But the reason why I like doing this first is to first show you some simplified options and to keep the conversation flowing and then have chat GPT reassess it. But for an example, if you did want to go ahead and skip all of the steps, I do have another prompt in here that you could use just like this to where you can skip the first two steps. And then it's going to go directly to just creating your prompt generator. However, I did find that the quality of prompts I get is much better if I follow the same exact protocol. Okay, so here we go. Let's go ahead and upload a brand new image. Now for this one, we're going to do a completely different subject. We're not going to go with a mega mansion this time. I want to make sure on this one that we get some great looking high quality AI influencer style images. So I'm in my AI influencers prompt database where this just contains nothing but prompts for AI influencers, including specific prompt generators for AI influencers. So let's go ahead and scroll until we find one that we want to emulate. So what I'll do is in the search bar, I'm going to go ahead and type in just the word Vogue and you could see 37 images are going to populate. This is one of my most favorited prompts because check these images out. Just the level of realism is insane. So let's go ahead and download this one for an example. Okay, this is also a great go-to one right here because it's going to be that editorial style, simple, but very, very high levels of clarity. In fact, we're going to start with this one right here. Let's now go back to chat GPT and all we have to do is just simply upload that image. Okay, I'll go to my downloads folder, click and drag and drop it right there. Perfect. Based on the stunning fashion portrait you uploaded, here it is. Now it understands exactly what this is, hyper-realistic editorial style image of a model against a vibrant yellow backdrop. Okay, now right away it's going to say reusable meta prompt generator. Now what it actually does is provide me with a template at first. So let's go ahead and select edit just to look at what it's going to give us. Now all we would have to do, we're going to use this whole entire prompt, but all we have to do is just place in the bracketed text our model description and then even any outfit or accessories. So this is basically a prompt template and a generator combo. Now let's scroll down and it says that. It says, how can you use it? Just replace these bracketed parts to generate endless variations. But look at this. Now down here at the bottom, if I open this one up, now it's going to give me a specific example prompt with its own subject and description, okay? We're going to try this one out as well. Now down here at the bottom, check this out. The questions ChatGPT asks you is really what takes your prompts to a whole new level. Would you like me to generate a fashion plus environment version or a dynamic pose generator for motion editorial sequences? Wow, let's keep that as a reminder because I do like this dynamic pose generator. However, let's say we want a true prompt generator. Sometimes you'll get a template, sometimes you'll get a template generator hybrid. Nonetheless, it's all about the conversation. So instead, let's say something like this. We're gonna say, no, I meant a true prompt generator, a reusable meta prompt that acts like your personal prompt engineer built specifically around the image I uploaded. And what I'll do is after meta prompt, I'll put in parentheses, not a template. As that's working, I'm gonna go ahead and copy this dynamic pose generator to also get this as well. And now here we go. Now it understands exactly what I was looking for. I'm not asking for a fill in the blank template. I'm asking for a system level meta prompt, a prompt that generates new prompts intelligently and automatically crafting image prompts tailored to your uploaded images, style, mood, lighting, realism. And so that's why I was hoping it would do this at first, because if you encounter responses like this to where you get more of a template rather than a true prompt generator, all you have to do is correct chat GPT, and then you'll end up getting exactly what you wanted, which is great because now not only that, not only am I getting the prompt generator, I'm getting so many amazing tools and resources I can use. Here it is, true meta prompt generator generator fashion editorial prompt engineer. Let's go ahead and open this one up. This is fantastic. There it is. There is a true prompt generator right here. Let's see if
if it gave me exactly what we were looking for. Absolutely. Please upload the reference image you'd like me to analyze. All right. So what I'll do now in this AI influencers database, I'm going to go ahead and type in the word selfie because this is the sort of image I'm looking for. Selfie style AI influencer image. Okay. Let's go ahead and download this image. We're going to use that one to upload in the chat GPT. Let's just go ahead and submit it. Perfect. Based on the image, here's a breakdown of the styling and technical setup. Now, this is so helpful because look at this. Remember, all of this critical information, these are keywords and these are going to be items you want to definitely save for future prompts. And now finally, we're going to get three new ultra realistic AI prompts that preserve this exact aesthetic and realism, each with a fresh twist. Okay, so we're getting a ton of prompts right now. Okay, so last but not least, remember, I wanted to also see what would happen if I said, yes, a dynamic pose generator. So with that copy, let's come back down here to the bottom and say, now I want a dynamic pose generator like you mentioned earlier. Oh, now we're gonna get another one, another long and amazing prompt generator for world-class fashion photography. I mean, the multitudes of important keywords and prompts and generators are almost endless. So there you have it, a great method to get some amazing prompts and prompt generators. Now, I know I showed you a multitude of steps, so you can choose to use some of the steps or also you can just skip them if you want and go straight to the prompt generator. But regardless, once you do this once, ChatGPT is going to provide you with a plethora of information and prompts. And so if you like this video, please remember to hit that subscribe button because it goes a long way. But until then, we'll see you next time.